Hi there, this is Perry and welcome to my first ever unboxing. <laughs> okay, so Christmas came early today and based on that, you now have an idea on what's inside. All right, so about a, a month ago, um, a friend of mine in Saigon, he's my toy supply here in Vietnam, uh, I asked him if he can buy me these uh, from the US and then he told me that he can. So I sent him the links from Walmart and we ordered them. He ordered them for me, okay? All right, let's go to the first figure. Ah, oh, nice uh, sealed air, whatever packaging here. All right, anyway, the first figure we have man at arms. Interesting, it looks good. Retro. Of course, the ones from Super 7 are more uh, detailed, but this one I am happy because it brings me back to the 80s when I first had them. Oh well, some of them. All right, so Man at Arms, very good. And then the second one, who's that? Ah, Tila. Okay, she's pretty. She looks like Princess Leia though, <laughs> but anyway. Again, this is the retro play line. They say modern posing, retro version of the toys, but modern posing. Tila, the heroic warrior goddess. All right, she looks good. Can't wait to remove that cobra armor right there. All right, next up. Okay, the other girl. It's evil Lin, the evil warrior goddess. Interesting, see? She's yellow. She's more of a neon yellow. Yeah. Yeah, all right. Cool. All right. Very good. All right. The next one is, okay, this evil man right here. Oh, we know what's the next figure already. Anyway. Okay, this figure is Skeletor, the evil lord of destruction. Ah, oh, scary. All right, so again, uh, do not compare this with Super 7 because this one is retro, just like they look like back in the 80s. All right, interesting there, Skeletor. And then at the back, the characters uh, that you need to complete this line. Yeah, there's Beast Man there. I don't have him because when we try to purchase these, He's out of stock and he's more expensive than He-Man for some reason. I don't know why. All right, so here we go. The main character of the Masters of the Universe. This is He-Man, the most powerful man in the universe. Look at that. The hair is bright yellow though, but it's okay. And the hair matches the whatever that is on the boots, the fur, all right? Okay, so He-Man, same pictures at the back. Last but not the least is this one. All right, this is let me take out of the box. Uh, he's actually the reason why I decided to buy this line because I've never had a battle cat before, even in the eighties. All right, so his name is Battle Cat fight mode. But if they're not fighting, if he's a normal tiger, his name is Cringer. And this is how it looks like. Mm -hmm. I think Cringer looks better than the one with the armor, but you know, that's how it is. All right, interesting. Look at that. Ah, I can't wait to open this box. Um, yeah. All right, I want to have different versions of He-Man. I don't know in the future, I might buy some, something from Super 7, but I'm happy with what I have right now. Look at that. So, I'm missing Beast Man only. And I try to buy Orko. I try to buy Orko, but he's also out of stock. If uh, you're not familiar with the show, Orko is the flying fella, magic with magic. Magical flying fellow right there. All right, so this is Masters of the Universe, new for 20. 
okay? Retro design with modern posting right there. So Tila, Heman, Skeletor, Eva Lynn, Man at Arms, and of course, Battle Cat or Cringer right there. All right, I'm so happy. All right, so again, this is my first ever toy unboxing. I might make a video uh, for each one of them. I might, <laughs> if I have the time, but so far this is what I have for this line. So, there you go. All right, thank you so much for watching and I hope if I, should I decide to make another unboxing, then I'll see you again. All right, this has been Perry. See you again. Ciao.